All right, YouTubers, here we go. This is the last and the final uh, part of the series. Uh, I might do a little extra on the color sanding and, uh, and buffing, uh, only because uh, I happen to uh, get a run in my clear coat right here. Um, one thing you're going to find out is your fingers become pretty tired afterwards, uh, after painting uh, the whole entire kit. And uh, you might want to switch to using your thumb, and which allows for more uh, pressure on the uh, nozzle. So that's what happened to me. My fingers got tired. Went ahead, pushed, started using my my thumb instead, and uh, kind of got a little carried away. And uh, I'm not sure if you can quite see the run and the clear right there, but that's no problem. You can uh, you can color sand and uh, color sand that right out. Uh, the whole kit's gonna get color, or the whole clear coat is gonna get uh, color sanded and buffed anyway. So I'm not really too worried about that. But as far as the uh, paint goes, uh, you can see right there. Um, came out really 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 nice uh, I can't complain the um, as you can see the uh, metallic flake and the pearl is just popping um, very satisfied with the product came out really really good um, for those of you who are looking to venture out and do this you know take your time when doing it um, it's not that hard it's not that difficult it just requires a little little work a little elbow grease you know uh, prepping your materials making sure you get it right before paint and, uh, and make sure there's no contaminants uh, on the actual material before you spray or you end up with some uh, some bubbling and some uh, I want to say like scattering sort of uh, little lines that come out in there um, I happen to get a, a one or two but you can't tell this part's gonna get covered with with the sticker um, uh, so that's not a really big deal to me at the moment um, but overall the uh, paint quality uh, way 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 better than what my stock kit looks right now so i'm totally satisfied with the product this is what she looks like as we spin around here came out excellent uh you know it's hard to tell with all the shadows and stuff but uh, yeah not a bad uh, overall job uh from beginning to end this took me about uh two weekends i don't really have that much time uh, to do it um wholeheartedly uh so i have to do it in sections so uh, last weekend I went ahead and prepped the uh, prepped the fairing, and uh, this weekend I went ahead and got and shot it. So um, so there it is, folks. Nice and easy, not too bad. And uh, if you're looking to do this yourself, highly recommend it. Highly recommend using the Colorite products uh, instead of just trying to go and grab something from your local uh, AutoZone or O'Reilly's Auto Parts. So uh, once again, as always, appreciate your time. See you next problem.